uh, we brought our car in last week and we were wondering if there were any updates. Yeah, because we haven't heard anything. Come around back. I am so ready to get our car back. You a brother, so I'm not even gonna hold you. Straight up, the engine is blown. It's gonna cost a pretty penny to get it repaired. What? How much? Yeah, when you say a pretty penny, how much are you talking about? Cuz, to be honest with you, we don't got it like that. It depends on what my boss says. Cuz since it's an older model, it might be hard to find. Can we take a look at it? Yeah, I mean, is it absolutely not drivable at all? We've had this car for a really long time. Yeah, man. Might want to take a few steps back, though. Trust me when I say that puppy is toast. <laughs> uh, okay. Yeah, that doesn't look good. Not at all. Yeah, now that we're looking at it, this does look like it's gonna be really expensive. Can you actually just uh, give us a minute to talk things over? Yeah, no rush. I'll go talk to my boss too. Okay, thanks. Well, um, what are we thinking? I mean, I really don't want to get rid of this car. Like I said, we've had it forever and I would hate to get rid of it. But, I mean, if it's not worth putting money into it, maybe we should look for a new car? I mean, we're here. A new car seems more reasonable. So that's it? We're just gonna have to say goodbye to our car? Well, it's not official yet. It depends on if we find something. So, I guess let's go ahead and take a look. If we just got the engine fixed, who knows what else will need to be fixed in the future? Okay, well then what's our budget? Because Christmas is coming right around the corner and we need to go shopping for the kids. So we can't completely break the bank. Yeah, uh, this definitely wasn't in my financial plan. Our max is 50k, nothing more. Okay, I think that's really reasonable. Had some time to talk it over? Yeah, um, we decided that we're actually gonna try to take a look at some of the cars you guys have for sale, if that's okay. For sure, I recommend that anyways, because you never know with these type of things. Okay, well, thanks for your help anyways. Um, we're gonna head inside now. Yeah, I got y'all. Thank, Thank you. you! Okay, well, let's go inside and see if someone can help us. Uh, hi there! Hey, come sit down! So, uh, what can I get started for you folks? Uh, we're actually looking to buy a new car for our family because our engine is busted. And, yeah, it's looking like we need a new one. Mm, yeah, no, that's no fun. Um, I can definitely help you guys out. Okay, um, can we take a look at the ones you have outside? Oh, yeah, for sure, let's go. Okay, come on, August. So, right over here, this is our Rope 500. It's about 18k, pretty nice car. Oh, Okay, um, yeah, I think this car would be a little too small for our family, right, August? I mean, it's in budget. You could squeeze them back there. No biggie. Yeah, that's definitely not big enough. I think we'll pass on this one. Okay, okay, tough crowd. This is the Roto minivan. Oh. It's about 52k, a little more pricey. Oh, 52k? Well, it's a little over our budget, but maybe. Um, do you have these in different colors, by the way? Um, we have one in red and another in brown. Oh, okay. Well, brown's nice. It's really spacious, too. I mean, it looks spacious. It's my dream mom van, basically. Let me wait to see what my husband thinks. I'm not going over 50k! Well, can we at least test drive it? I think you should. See? What's your name, Ace? Ace thinks we should. Let's do it. We're not committing to anything. You can test it out all you want. It's not coming home with us. Okay, okay, I'll test it out. And that's it, promise. Wow, just imagine this in brown. Pass me the keys, thank you. See, imagine August, look, I could go pick up Leo in the future cause we all know he's gonna play soccer. And wow, okay, here, let me go in. Come on, what are you waiting for? I'm trying to make the most of this situation. Whoa, okay, leg room. This is what I like to see. All right, let me not crash this thing because we definitely can't afford that. 
All right, I'll just drive down this way. Whoa! You can't tell me that you dislike this car, August. It's just a little over budget. Come on, we could possibly make it work, right, Ace? Yeah, I think this is perfect. Who knows, you might have a bigger family in the future. I don't dislike it, I dislike the price. The price is just a number, it's just a mindset. See, just a mindset. Well, maybe we can come back to it, because I don't think he's really sold on this one, but I'll try my best to talk him into it, maybe? I don't know. I'm realizing I've never driven a van before, so kind of kind of struggling right now. I think I might have hit that car just a little bit. Well, it's fixed. See, is there anything on this car? No, it looks fine. Here's the keys, Ace. Thanks. Well, I guess on to the next car. So right over here, we have our Ford Summit XL. It's about 160K, a little bit on the pricey side, but just look at this car. 160K? Oh. Yeah, but you know, just the mindset. How much? I mean, it's a beautiful car. Next. It's super safe, has sensors, it's perfect for a family. Sensors? Come on, isn't safety important? What about the other one? Are there any cool features for this one? Not really. This is one of our lower minivans, but this one, this is where it's at. You got me messed up. Oh, seriously? Come on, look at the space, the windows, there's a sunroof. It's beautiful. All this trunk space, we could take so many road trips. You'll be paying for it by yourself then. Oh, on, on second thought, Ace, uh, show us the next car. <laughs> So right over here, we've got the Terra Trek Life pickup truck. It's about 130000 I think this is perfect. You've always wanted a pickup truck. Now you know I like me a truck. Yeah, that's that country boy in you. See? Wait, can we even, can we sit back here? Here, let me just go ahead and open up the tailgate for you. Oh, wow, that's so cool. Thank you. All right, let me climb up here. Oh, okay, this is spacey, but I think that they would call CPS if we dropped the kids off at school like this. This is crazy. I mean... No, 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 no. it's perfect. They'll it's love perfect it. perfect? For the children? They need the, they need the fresh air, right? Um, I mean, I, I guess that's true. They already get fresh air. Well, that, that's also true, August. You're gonna, you're gonna say no to your dream truck? You sure about that, man? As much as I like it, it's not practical. Nothing more practical than a truck. Okay. It's safe, it's perfect, you can haul stuff. Maybe in the future, but definitely not now. Uh, you are no fun. This is crazy. How much was this one again? Oh, just 130000 And, you know. uh, we might just have to get the car we had. What's this one? Wait a minute. This is the Opulent Astro 200. It's pretty new. The Opulent Astro? That sounds so cool. Wait, how much is it? Well, it's actually only 40K. 40K! See? That's a good price. That's within our budget. Hmm. And, and it's perfect for our hot moms. Oh, well, well, I'm a hot mom. Okay. Um, what do you think about it, August? I mean, it's, it's kind of a funny shape, but... What did he say? Uh... Um, I actually, f I forgot what he said. Oh, he said, how much do you like the car? Yeah, do you like it or or no? I do. And the color is so, so pretty. Wait, do you also have this in red? Yeah, we have it in almost every color. Oh, okay. I mean, the green is pretty, but we have a green house and I just think that's a lot of green. I kind of like the red car vibe. Let's see how it drives. Okay. Uh, one in. You can drive in. I mean, you can drive this one here. Let me give you the keys. There you go. Oh, wow. This car has a really nice interior. Yeah, it feels pretty nice. It's perfect. If you get mess on it, you can clean it up real easy. Mm, that would be perfect for us because we have two young kids and they're always spilling stuff and eating in the car. Are these leather seats? More like leather. Oh, okay. Well, let's go ahead and take it for a drive then. How's it feel? Oh, this one kind of goes a little fast. I mean, we should be able to manage it, though. I think this is the best one. Finally, you like something. I like this one, too. But the thing is, it only fits four people. Well, actually, if you just lift this middle part up right here, it turns into another seat. Wait, really? 
Yeah. Oh, okay. Well, I think we can work with that. Okay, before we commit to anything, what about this one? It's, it looks like a newer model than the one we had. Oh yeah, this is our Bloxy Voyage. It's about 25000 pretty cheap. But I, I don't know, I really like the one we just saw. What did you say it was called again? The Opulent Astro 200. The Opulent Astro 200. Well, um, if you don't mind, can we have a moment to uh, talk it over? Oh yeah, no, of course. Can I get you guys anything? Um, some coffee? Yeah. Coffee for me as well. All right, I'll be back out. Okay, thanks. We could just get this car again and keep it simple, but it seems like we both really like this one. If we're getting something new, we might as well upgrade. Oh my goodness, I'm so excited. Wait, let me take one more good look at it. I mean, it's not the most spacious car. It's kind of compact, but we, we could make it work. I don't know. I like it. I'm sold. I'm back with coffees. Oh, thank you. So, have we decided on the car yet? This is the one. Yep, we're deciding to go with this one. Okay, uh, are you sure you don't want one of the more pricier ones, like this one right here? Uh, no, I, I think that one's way, way over budget. But nothing's too expensive when it comes to kids, right? When you put it that way, absolutely not! Okay, no, we, we can't go with this car. Maybe, maybe in the future. All right, all right. So if you just follow me inside, we can get everything settled in there. All right, and so it's the opulent Astro 200, right? Uh, yes, that's the one we're gonna go with. Perfect, so that's just 60K. 60? You said 40 out there. Um, no, I'm pretty sure I said 60. Um, no, we're pretty sure you said 40 because our budget is 50. Not you're trying to play us. Look, lady, take it or leave it. I don't got all day. Look, lady, take it or leave it? Who are you talking to? You know what? This is why we can go to Mike's Motors. Yeah, we'll take our business elsewhere. How about that? All right, all right. Chill. Hold up. Oh, no. I see now. Yeah, it, it is 40K. I see. We're going to have to watch you for this process. Anyways, yes, we agreed on 40K. So where do we sign? Uh, Just right here and right there. And if you flip the other page, it's right there. What you're not going to do is play me. It was just a simple mistake. No one's trying to play you. Uh-huh. Now, let me go ahead and read this over. Gotta read the fine print. Make sure you didn't switch anything up. Um, here, August, you can look over it, too. Okay, uh, here's the pen so you can sign. Are we eligible for a trade-in for the parts of our car that actually work? Uh, yeah. Yeah, we can do that. Oh, okay. So in that case, um, how much is the total price? One second. Okay, looks like it should be 35k. Now that's what I'm talking about. So how are we paying today? Card, cash, check? It'll be card. All right, sounds good. And what's the pin number for this? 1056. And don't be saving my card numbers anywhere. All right, 1056. And uh, yeah, no, we, we would never. Let me enter this into the system and we can get you guys your papers and have you on your way. Sounds good. Alrighty, everything's set. Here are your keys. And we'll get that car for you in red. Okay, thank you. Yeah, of course. Come again. Oh my gosh, we finally have our new car. It's gorgeous. It looks even better in red. Wait a minute. This ain't right. Are you seeing what I'm seeing? There's a scratch right there. The paint is literally coming off. The window is chipped. The license plate is falling off. Hold up. What the heck? This man scammed us. Uh-uh. Go get him. This is crazy. Um, excuse me over here, Ace. Yeah, what seems to be the problem? What do you mean what seems to be the problem? Look at this mess. Mmm, I don't see anything. What do you mean you don't see anything? Do you need to use my husband's glasses? What are you talking about? I'm so mad I can't even talk. The... The paint is chipped right there. The license plate is falling off. Are you blind? Now, let's be for real. It was probably y'all that did that. 
we we did not do this. You brought the car out for us, and then you ran inside. Mm -hmm. No, I think I remember it a different way. What? Dude, you scammed us. Oh, well, it looks perfectly fine to me. So that's a you issue. It's in your name, so you deal with it. How about I call corporate and get you fired? Or you can just take it to our mechanic. Take it to your mechanic? What? Our engine was actually probably fine. You probably had the mechanic break it. Oh my gosh, what are we supposed to do? Who's paying for that? You? No, it's actually my lunch break. Your lunch break? Oh, so, uh, good luck with that. Are you kidding me? Wait! Ace! We got scammed! So, that's it? I mean, we already paid for it. I don't know about you, but I'm thinking about reporting this to the police. Honestly, I guess that's a good idea. This guy needs to be locked up. Well, we need to make it home, so are we driving this piece of crap home or are we walking? Please don't say walking. You're not gonna like my answer. August, no, can we just take the car and deal with it later? I guess we can. Thank you. Just call corporate later and hopefully we can get a replacement car because this company is definitely crooked. All right, let's go home. Hey babies, what do y'all want for lunch? I just got off the phone with your parents and they said they're on the way. Hmm. Oh, do we have those pizza rolls? Let me check the freezer. Knowing your father, the possibility is high. Pizza rolls are my favorite. Well, let's pray we have some. I got you. Leo, enough. Hush all that noise, you two. Granny's head is feeling a little sore right now. I'm just playing. Tell Leo to stop. He won't. Well, I don't think your big sister wants to play right now. Leo, how about you help me with the pizza rolls? Yay, okay. Give me that, because you don't need it. Go ahead and put that up, Layla. Thank you. Happened. How crazy, right? I can't wait until tomorrow. They're not going to say what's coming. Hello, guys. We're home. Mom. Hey, Layla. Dad. Mommy. Daddy. Hi, Leo. Hi, you two. How was car shopping? Hi, kiddos. Uh, Mom, car shopping was crazy. We made pizza rolls. Oh, wow. How cool. Your dad's definitely going to want some of those. But as I was saying, um, we did buy a new car, but we kind of got scammed. Scammed? Uh-huh. Yeah, that guy was a real smart Alec. What's scammed? Is it bigger? Yeah, it, it's bigger than the one we had. See, that's why I never trust those fancy smancy car places. It's all about the money. Well, Layla, there's a lot of different types of scamming. In this case, uh, this guy tricked us and he got some money he shouldn't have. I want to be a scammer when I grow up. I miss the good old days where if someone said something, nine times out of ten, you could trust them. They're going to be out of business soon. Don't worry. Let's see this new car. All right. We decided to stick with the red theme because I think it's really good. But this is what we have. It's pretty scratched up and dented and chipped and the license plate is falling off. It's crazy. Oh my, look at this, ridiculous. Oh no, what happened? That guy was a really, really bad man. We paid 40K for this car, mom. This is just awful. And he tried to trick us and say it was 60 at first. I'm glad we were paying attention. 40,000? Yeah, 40,000. These times have not been kind to anyone. Looks like we'll be eating pizza rolls for the rest of our lives. I'm gonna check my bank statement too, to make sure he didn't upcharge us on the low. You should not have paid all that money for this quality. I know, I know, and I feel so dumb. But he showed us the original and it was perfect. It was great. And then when we asked for the one in red, he brought out this one. I may be older, but that will never stop me from straightening out a few people. These are the life lessons you learn. 
I guess, but it sucks. And the holidays are right around the corner, so we're gonna have to figure all this out. I cannot believe we got scammed while car shopping, but I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye! But I can't, scared to